As a new multi-millionaire, he is of course the winner of the Catch the Ace lottery that went on for a number of weeks in Hagersville. Well, today we hear from the winner along with his wife and as Sean Cowan reports, Catch the Ace was such a hit, it'll be back soon. Fresh out of the creek. Fresh out of the creek. Meet Richard Marshall, a retired commercial fisherman and his wife Lorna. They live above their bait shop on a remote property in Nanticoke and last week, Richard's ticket won just over $2 million with Catch the Ace. Do you feel like millionaires? No. No, I just feel like I always did. <laughs> that don't make no difference. No, it no, matter. don't matter. Richard and Lorna's friend Bob actually waited in line and got their ticket for them. And then they got a call last Thursday from that same friend. He called, he said, Richard, you won the darn the money. I said, you're lying. <laughs> no, he said, I'm not. Yeah, Bob Fibbs. The weekly Catch the Ace draw has been raising money for local charities in Hagersville, the Food Bank, the Hospital Foundation, and the Lions Club. For the past 45 weeks, the anticipation has been building, with no one winning the jackpot until this past week. It is, it is, it is unbelievable. Such a runaway success and such an extraordinary happening here in Hagersville. Uh, I couldn't believe it, and I still am processing it. It's, it was so much fun, and we did so much good. The Lions Club says in total, around $3 million was raised for charity. Richard and Lorna plan on sharing their $2 million with their five children and taking a little vacation. All I'm ever going to do, we're going to go to Switzerland. That's it. And a lot of people may be having Catch the Ace withdrawal, but I'm told not to worry. Two more organizations will actually be starting up their own versions of Catch the Ace, one in Fisherville, the other one in Caledonia. And we should be hearing those details very soon. Adam, back over to you.